What's up guys, it's me, your badass host, Draven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Brown walkthrough. Okay, so there is a little something that I just realized. I, uh, <laughs> I can evolve my Electabuzz right now if I wanted to. And, uh, well, what I'm going to do right here is there is a Pokemon here that I'm probably going to have to uh, I'm gonna have to part ways with for a while. That is more than likely going to be, let's see, who can I part ways with? It can't be Bruce Lee. Like, I'm really, really attached to all these Pokemon. So for right now, let's go with Hurricane. Mainly because it's a flying-type Pokemon. And, uh, well, there is a little something going that's going to happen eventually. I did capture myself a Marowak. Now, I kind of want to change this box right here. And let's go straight to box number two. And grab ourselves Kid Thunder right here. Because, yes, he is a, a tank of everything. Now... We did get ourselves an Electrizer somewhere, yeah, in the, yeah, we got it over in the uh, power plant, and because of that, we can actually evolve Kid Thunder right here, and look at this, bam, Kid Thunder, digivolving to its final form right there, look at that, say hello to Electrovire, and holy crud, let's go ahead and take a look at our new Pokemon, Electivire, Kid Thunder's new form. It is powerful on its attack, its physical attack, and well, as you can see, it doesn't really have that much in, uh, much in him right now. But eventually, it's going to be a very powerful Pokemon. Now, let's see. Our next mission right here is we have to go into another gym. I don't know which gym it is, but I'm gonna try it out. And you know, we're gonna have to go through the Castro Valley uh, forest in order to get through the get to that location so we're gonna not go here we do not have the SSN ticket just about yet and well let's go right here right oh this is the wrong place right here now I did capture myself a Pidgey off screen so that is another Pokemon right there that we can uh, you know trade for a good chancy and well what I'm gonna do right now is I'm gonna speed through this guys I'll be right back with you I'm gonna get to the tail end of this whole location right here see you guys Alrighty guys, so I'm back and we're at the tail end of the Castro Valley Forest and now We're gonna make our way right here now You can surf your way down here and it will actually lead you into two directions and one being to Well, I believe Alsari. No, not probably. Yeah, Alsari City. I think I don't know shoot and another one to an unknown gym I would like to say the Castro Valley gym. No, it, we already been through a Castro Valley gym and well, here we are taking on a Marowak. This is where I actually located that Marowak. And well, I am going to escape. As you can see, Electrovire is looking like a badass. Okay, so do that. And well, let's go right ahead and figure this gym out right here. As you can see, this gym is the out of city Pokemon gym leader, Joe. Mira, of course, has defeated this guy. Now, this guy right here is going to be saying, Yo, champ in the making! Joe uses only normal type Pokemon. I wonder what... Uh, I would recommend using fighting uh, fighting those, against those po opponents. Okay. So, this is kind of like the... What was it? The Cinnabar Island Gym, where you're probably going to have to answer some questions right here. So, let's go right ahead and go right behind this guy. And Pokemon Quiz Monkey is a fighting type. Yes, it is. And go on right through. Okay, so it's the same thing as the Cinnabar Island Gym. And, well, I thought I was, a, uh, you know, I thought I was, yeah, I thought I was stuck right there. So, it looks like that we have to battle some Pokemon trainers right here. Let's see. Well, ready? Yes, we are. Okay, so here we go. Going up against a Super Nerd, and he's coming with his Pidgeot, so, Wow. I didn't expect that. We have got to switch it up to Kid Thunder right here. All buffed up and ready to go. Normal type Pokemon, and this guy coming with, you know, a quick attack right here. Holy crud. Okay, so here comes an agility by Pidgeot, and let's go straight ahead. Thundershock, not super effective, but here comes that wing attack. Oh, gravy. Okay, here we go. Thundershock, do it again. Come on! Wing attack. Oh my god. Okay, so here we go. Kid Thunder doing it again. And... Oh, nearly defeats him. Quick attack. God dang it! 
Oh man, Kid Thunder nearly had it. And well, let's see. And let's go with Kathy right here. Alrighty, let's go. Ice Beam attack. This Pidgeot right here using its uh, agility. Now we're taking on some Pokemon that are like 11 levels uh, higher than us. And well, let's see. He's coming out with a Dodrio. Let's continue on with Kathy right here. Ice Beam. And here comes the Fury. Holy crud. Holy crud. We are... <laughs> this is not a normal type gym. This is a bug or a freaking... This is a freaking whatchamacallit bird type gym. This is what it is. And here comes a Growl attack. Oh my god. Okay. Here we go. And well, let's see. About to come out with a Persian, so let's go straight to the guy that we were supposed to use. And there he is. Alrighty, Persian versus Mipmon Lee. Let's go with the rolling kick, and here comes a screech, but it doesn't work. Rolling kick rolls, Persian. Yeah, buddy. Look at that. Okay. Alrighty, so there we go. Dang, okay. And that opens up a door right there, so, uh, <laughs> yeah, okay. So, there is going to have to be a little bit of a change right here. Let's see, we got the TM25. This is Thunder. Yeah, it would work perfectly for Kid Thunder right here, just because it, yeah. The Thundershock, it's not, it's not to my liking. Let's take away Leer, just for this situation. And, well, let's see. Go ahead and use a revive here somewhere. Alright, Kid Thunder. Come on, man. You're making your debut. Why are you messing it up? I do not know. And let's see, let's see, let's see. We're gonna have to oh yeah, we're gonna have to stock up on these super potions too. Okay, here we go. There we go. And there we go. Okay, so, I guess we're gonna have to battle this guy. You are abnormal, does not welcome here. Okay, so here we go, going up against a super nerd, and well, he's coming out with his level 44 Eradicate. Yeah, we are going, we are in for a, uh, <laughs> a big time match right here, and here we go, rolling kick. And that nearly takes out Raticate, and here comes a quick attack. And that nearly takes my Pokemon out, so here comes a double kick for the win. Bruce Lee grows to level 34, and here he's gonna come out with a, a Tauros, a freaking Tauros, good gravy! And there is the Leer attack right there, so let's just go ahead and whoop this guy. And here comes a Tail Whip, this guy's gonna try and weaken us. Another rolling kick, does the trick, say goodbye to Tauros. And, well, he's coming out with another Raticate, so let's go ahead and go with Ultra Psycho right here. Alright. Let's do it. Alright, Noise Pulse. Oh, damn, okay, oh, damn, that looks like, a uh, Psywave. Not super effective, it, but it became confused, which is good. And it's hurting itself, okay, so that gives us a little bit of an advantage. Here we go, Psybeam for the win. And, oh wow, how could you not, oh wow, okay, so we're, we're really, really getting screwed right here. Let's go, Psybeam, win it. Okay, look at that, look at that. And he's coming out with a Wigglytuff. I wonder. Noise Pulse, here we go. And it doesn't affect Wigglytuff, good gravy. Okay, so let's go with a Psybeam. Sound type Pokemon. I kind of want to know a little bit more about these guys, right? And Psybeam. Taking care of Wigglytuff, and it is confused, and it is putting, almost putting me to sleep. So let's go with a Tri Attack. And that is not effective. Good gravy. Come on, hurt yourself. Hurt yourself. Yes. Throwing out that peace sign. I am throwing out that peace sign. Alrighty. Wow. Okay, so... <laughs> I'll be right back with you guys. Uh, we need 
to change a few things up. We need to buy some stuff and we need to, yeah, equip some Pokemon up. So I'll be right back with you guys. Alrighty, guys. So we did a little bit of exploring and, uh, well, I did check on the internet what TMs could actually help me out. Honestly, not one of the TMs that I have collected can help me out except for maybe, just maybe, uh, what was it called? Uh, Seismic Toss. But that all depends on a Pokemon's, uh, that all depends on a Pokemon's weight. So we're going to continue on right here. We did get ourselves some extra potions just for this occasion. And Pewter City Gym is in Johto. No. And yes, we are absolutely correct. And we are going to be going right through this whole location now. This thing pauses for quite some time. And well, let's see. Pokemon Quiz. Mer Meryl isn't catchable in Region. Yes. Oh, damn. Okay, so here we are going to be battling this guy. And he's like, I'm really normal. Okay, alrighty, so here we go. Super Nerd wants the battle, and he is coming out with a Snorlax. Now, good gravy, the, the creators of this game, he did not hold back on the Pokemon, and holy jeebus, Snorlax. And that right there takes me out. Jesus criminy, okay. Let's go. Oh, you know what, Kid Thunder? Snorlax weighs a ton, so... Let's go with a Seismic Toss. This is the perfect candidate for this one. There we go. And that right there. Well, going with his Amnesia. Let's go with a Thunder Attack right here. And yes, here comes the Body Slam. But good thing Kid Thunder's a little beefy, so it might... Oh, no, it did not survive it. Good jeebus. Alrighty. Oh, man. Yeah, we are... We are getting messed up here. Normal type Pokemon are not to, to be taken lightly here, guys. So there we go. Psybeam attack. And there we go. Critical hits. Yes, we're gonna have to t we're gonna have to throw everything in the kitchen sink at Snorlax. And well, we have defeated a super nerd right there. That was all our, our fault for uh, getting the correct the answer cor incorrectly. And let's see. You can trade Pokemon to Prism. Yes. Okay, we can. Pokemon Prism is actually the, I believe, the the sequel to this game right here. And, well, we got one more. And, let's see, Johto is in the south of Rijon. No. It's up north right here. And, well, that is that right there. So, let's see. There's a trainer. Let's go right ahead and heal our Pokemon because, uh, yeah. <laughs> Yeah, we got messed up pretty badly by that one single sword. <laughs> God dang, Snorlax, I hate you. And look at that, we're reviving both Kit Thunder and Bruce Lee. And, well, let's see. Let's see, let's go with a Hyper Potion. Hyper Potion to Kit Thunder. And... Hyper Potion to Bruce Lee right here. Now, I'm going to do a little something different right here because I have a feeling that this guy's going to come out with like some flying type Pokemon. So let's go ahead and switch out to Kathy right here. And let's go ahead and save this game just in case we mess up or something. Alright, here we go. Let's do this. Ha! I am Joe, the leader of this gym. My normal Pokemon never have never lost a match. Draven, well, I'll do anything for the white badge. Huh, the white badge. Okay, so here we go. Taking on Joe. And he's coming out with a Raticate at level 50. Good God! Okay. We're gonna have to be strategic magic for this one right here. We are oh so underleveled, and here we go, Confuse Ray. There we go. And here comes an ice beam, and this guy's going with a Yeah, he's going with uh yeah, he's gonna try and heal this Pokemon right here. Come on, hurt yourself. There we go. So everything's going our way right now. And there goes Raticate. Eat it. Eat a butt. And Kathy has grown to level 34, which is great. And here comes its Persian. So let's go right ahead and go straight to Bruce Lee. And this Persian right here is at level 48, so it shouldn't be a problem, I think. I don't know. And why are you using a Super Potion on your Pokemon? I do not know. Let's go with a Rolling Kick and Payday will actually give us a little bit more bucks. I don't know. But here comes a Rolling Kick. And 
and there goes Persian. What now? What what in the butt? Look at that. And well, let's see. He's coming out with a Pidgeot. This is the Pokemon I'm well, I'm a little afraid of because yeah, it is a flying type Pokemon, still normal. But good thing we got Kid Thunder. Let's go with a thunder attack, and yes, whirlwind does not work on me. Good gravy, come on! Here comes the agility. And here's the thunder. And that is super effective. Oh yes, Pidgeot, you're looking at it. Oh yes. There we go. Time to finish this guy off. Kid Thunder for the win. What now? Say hello to level 39. Alrighty. And he's about to come out with Snorlax. Now this guy is going to be tough. Level 53. We're going to have to put Screech on this guy. Just to hurt it really, really badly. And here comes a Body Slam. It looks like Kid Thunder is going to be... Uh, sacrificial Lamb right here. We're going to have to throw in two Screech just to hurt this man. And, oh, actually another one. Here we go. So he's making it easier for me to defeat this guy. And here comes a double edge attack, which, yeah, it is a recoil attack. So Kid Thunder did his job. Let's go straight back to Bruce Lee. All right, Bruce Lee. Time to do the rolling kick. And look at that. Ooh. <laughs> First time for everything. Good old Draven does some strategic. Alrighty. And we've earned the white badge and picked up 96 bucks and well, let's see. Ha! Since you, you're, you're special, I'll give you something else. We get ourselves the TM-15. It contains Hyper Beam. It's so strong that your Pokemon must recharge after using it. Oh, okay. Uh, best normal type you can uh, get. Don't waste it. Well, you can actually buy it elsewhere. You guys do know that, right? You can go over to Hayward City, I think. Yeah. Speaking of Hayward City, I do remember a little something something, and that is that you can get some starter Pokemon in Hayward City if you just buy them. So, that is pretty much it for this episode, guys. I didn't expect going into this ep this uh, gym right here. Didn't even know there was a gym. And, well, look at that. We got ourselves our sixth badge. And it's not going to get easy from here. That right there is the second to, to last strongest trainer right there. So, in the next episode, we're going to be going east. Northeast. No, we're going to go west. To uh, We're going to be going west to see where we can actually go from here. So... Thank you guys for watching. I will see you guys next time.